wait. Do not interfere, Witcher. Remember what I did to the last fool who interrupted me. You grant wishes, right? Grant mine and release him. He must repay his debt. Let him go, and I'll take it on. We'll call it mine. Do you wish to give your soul for his? No, but we can play for them. I lose, you take mine and all Geert's. But if I win, you release us both. What do you propose we play? Gwent? Don't know. Maybe we can bet on a challenge. You know I'm good at accomplishing the impossible. Seen me do it. Hmm. Very well. But we shall do this my way. What's happening? You wish to play. So let us play. I shall tell you a riddle. Solve it, and both you and Olgird will be free. And if I don't? <laughs> then we'll all three go for a wild ride. It's what you proposed, is it not? The riddle. Let me hear it. To all things and men I appertain, and yet by some am shunned and disdained. Fondle me and ogle me till you're insane, but no blow can harm me, cause me pain. Children delight in me, elders take fright, Fair maids, rejoice and spin. Cry and I weep. Yawn and I sleep. Smile and I shall grin. What was that supposed to be? You tell me. What am I? You're going down. We shall see, my friend. You must find me before the sand in the hourglass runs out. Ready? Let's begin. this place <laughs> you like it plenty more where it came from just remember you must find me before time runs out not bad monsters weren't part of the deal my world my rules Cry and I weep, yawn and I sleep, smile and I too shall grin. Mm. Something that repeats all I do? Maybe an echo? Echo. No dice. You can't possibly ogle an echo. Children delight in me, elders take fright. Fair maids rejoice and spin, cry and I weep, yawn and I sleep, smile and I too shall grin. Damn it, what are you?
Shani. Hang on, I'm coming. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe you fell for that. Is it about swords that turns men into utter fools when they see one for the taking? Through howling winds, pouring rain, with their life hanging by a thread. Which reminds me, time is running out. Children delight in me, elders take fright. Fair maids rejoice and spin. Children and young folk like swings be scary to old folk too uh, doesn't fit the other verses though to all things and men i tame and yet by some am shunned and disdained fondle and ogle me till you're insane but no blow can harm oh me awful mm, you're what doing that be? remember you always give up as i see it you will never find me Some am shunned and disdained. Could be family, I guess. Wouldn't match much else in the riddle, though. Repeat the riddle. To all things and men I appertain, and yet by some am shunned and disdained. Fondle and ogle me till you're insane, but no blow can harm me, cause me pain. Children delight in me, elders take fright. Rejoice and spin. Cry and I weep. You This place. <laughs> you like it? Plenty more where it came from. Just remember, you must find me before time runs out. Monsters weren't part of the deal. My world. Cry and I weep, yawn and I sleep. Smile and I too shall grin. Hmm. Something that repeats all I do? Maybe an echo? 
Echo. No dice. You can't possibly ogle him. Children delight in me. Elders take fright. Fair maids rejoice and spin. Cry and I weep. Yawn and I sleep. Smile and I too shall grin. Damn it, what are you? Children delight in me, elders take fright. Fair maids rejoice and sp Children and young folk. Mm, that to all things and men I appertain, and yet by some am shunned and disdained. Fondle and ogle me till you're insane. But no blow can Oh, me. oh! Mm, you're doing what could that, that be? End. Remember, you can always give up. As I see it, you will never find me. No. Mirror. So this is where you're hiding. <laughs> Calm down. You didn't expect it to be that easy, did you? You say, yet I wait and wait and nothing. So, any better? Yeah, thanks. Wine's revived me a bit. 
This plonk could revive a corpse. An exquisitely rank vintage. You know what, though? It's good at last to taste something real. So, have at it. Tell me what the blaze has just happened. Your brand's gone. Guessing that's a good sign? Master Mirror, uh, the details don't matter. I beat him. You're free. I thank you. Though I've no notion what to do with this freedom now. Mirror took everything. Everything I loved. All I held dear. Not true. Got your heart back. A bitter victory. Now at last I sense how much I've lost. I have a heart again. Yet all it feels is grief, sadness and defeat. My life is a ruin. You've handled tougher situations. You'll figure this one out. Got a company of faithful comrades waiting. Got a home, your fortune. No. I cannot live as I did before. So what'll you do? I don't know. But one thing's clear. It's time I took fate into my own hands. Lived life anew. And truly, this time. Sounds like a plan. I'll never forget what you did for me, Witcher. I have something for you. Can't accept this. You can, and must. This saber's been in my family for generations. Even when I'd lost all else, it remained at my side. Means a great deal to me. All the more reason why I can't take it. Do me the honor. This'll mark the start of my new life. And such a weapon could be right useful to you. Thank you. Ow! Sorry. You needn't be. I thank you again, Geralt. And good luck on the path. Good luck to you too.
His long search for Ciri led Geralt to conclude that Uma, the ugliest man alive and the victim of a curse, was the key to finding the young woman. Geralt needed to lift the curse. So he took Uma to the home of the world's greatest specialists on dark spells. To the Witcher's Fortress of Kaer Morin. like <laughs> like hey happen to know how the hell i can walk on that water naturally i know since time immemorial have i dwelt in solitude on this shore and i can testify to the extraordinary nature of the lake what's so extraordinary about it I mean, besides the fact that you can walk on its surface. A sword, most wondrous, lies in its depths. I watch over it. The blade may be grasped solely by one who possesses the five chivalric virtues. Folk call me a lot of things, but virtuous? I don't know. Yet I do know, for I know who you are. You have proven yourself capable of great sympathy. You are a man of honor, as many can attest. Of humble means yourself. You show generosity to others. Your valor is the stuff of legends. Reason guides your actions, as it does those of all who are wise. You have proven the five chivalric virtues dwell in your heart. You mean the sword's mine? I can dive in and take it? The sword deserves the hand of a master. You must prove your skills are worthy through combat atop the water's surface. Are you ready? Anytime. Then draw your blade. You have 
have proven worthy of wielding the blade. Beyond all doubt. Behold, your Arendite. We've met before. Certainly. The Hermit admitted he knew you, remember? The Lady of the Lake. It is I. Forget not that you are a man right and honorable, devoted to doing good. And for these reasons you received the blade. Now bear it. And I trust this time you shall not lose it. Catching somebody.
Even a horse drops if you ride it at a constant gallop. What is it? Ah. High and mighty northerner dog diddled down the river. Knights and ladies decorous, gaze at the host assembled before us. Look upon chivalry's best and most storied. Come from far lands, here to seek glory. Hear now their names as I shout them aloud. Savor their titles of their presence, be proud. Palmerin the Baron of Longfall. Linus of Metida. Rainfarn of Atra, Paul Makaspach of Meicht, Donimir of Troy, Guy de Boisfren, in service to the Duchess, Delwyn of Craigiau, Count Ty of Dondal. And say of Lyria and Rivia a prince. Geralt of Rivia. For Gregoire of Mount Gorgon, let out a roaring cheer. The faint fire of silence, tawny champion from last year. Today's winner of contests, his victory to secure, shall face a Gregoire in a challenge severe. Does ignorance demand a part in deceit? Does someone need telling how tawnies proceed? Yes, I do, if you please. Ere the sands from the clouds retire? Any chance you could say it normally? None at all. <clears throat> Ere the sands from the clouds retire, and hearty toil your steeds does tire? Beneath all the gates you must guide your horse, and each of five targets strike with bolts. Each dummy felt adds more sand to the glass, and each true shot bolt repeats the task. Yep, all clear now. How dare you enter a tourney for nobly born knights? Your knighthood came through the grace of my mother Meath, Queen of Lyria and Riffia, whom you treacherously deserted mere days later. Your presence here is an offense to my honor. And yours is an offense to my eyes. If you're done, step aside, Prince. The Tony's protector, the mate Fithian. Her beauty entrances both beasts and men. My heart's greetings, dear knights. May my grace guide you and show you the path of honor, valor, and glory. Accept my wishes of good fortune, sir, and devote all your strength to the tourney, and only it. The time has come for you, Sir Knight. Mount your steed. Swift be your flight. Ladies and gentlemen of lineage illustrious, soon steeds shall swarm like ants most industrious. To beat time's passage, they'll ride like the gale. What a sight to behold, what a lark, what a tale. Before us, Geralt, from Rithia come, fast as the wind, bright as the sun. First, he's up, with a thunderous roar, who pounds the ground. No legion of trammers could make such a sound.
Come on, Roach. A failure, a loss, a tragic tip. Let us hope with its sword he makes not a slip. Come with me to the feast. We shall await Vivian together, wine in hand. Lead the way. So, any thoughts on Vivian? Her beauty's striking. That is not what I ask. Still too early to say anything I'd be willing to stand behind. Managed to figure one thing out. She uses powerful magic, masking illusions. Do you mean to say she might in truth look different than she seems? Only guessing right now. Found some clues. Got me wondering if your beloved Vivian's not a Bruxa. A Bruxa? You mean a... a vampiress? Not sure yet. We've still some time before Vivian arrives. Let us drink. To Vivian, may you find the means to aid her. To Vivian. Ah, uh, when I first laid eyes on her, I finally understood what all those poems and ballads were trying to say. Love's not poetry alone. Sometimes it's prose. Sometimes it's just plain ugly. You say that only because you do not know Vivian as I do. A life with her would be sweetness itself. Actually, you don't know her all that well either. Her presence at this tourney is an affront to my honor. I demand satisfaction. Head to the nearest brothel, then. Coward. Mounted combat in the main arena. I challenge you. Since you insist, I'm all yours. You shall bitterly regret deserting my mother's army once I'm done with you.
May the blood I will spill wash away the stain of your cowardice. Let's get this over with. Quick. Three, two, one. have seen fit to punish you for your cowardice. Yada, yada, you won, whatever. Now let me explain something. Had to abandon your mother's camp back then because someone else needed my help. Badly. Couldn't refuse them. Didn't want to, in fact. You mean to say you had a secret mission set off to accomplish it, having vowed to tell no one of its nature until you did? Something like that. Minus the vow. And, uh... I'd still rather not divulge the nature of my secret mission. Can you accept that as justification? In agreeing to Jewel, you proved yourself a true knight. Thus, I accept your word as that of a man of honor. Glad to hear it. Now I got work to do. My heart swells to behold this beautiful celebration of valor and honor, and to witness you, who embody the chivalric virtues in your lives, strive for greatness. Yet, after a time of combat must come a time of peace and respite. Thus, I invite all who fought in the tourney to this feast held in your, and none others, honor. And should any among you crave solitude, Private tents await you nearby. The group melee shall take place on the morrow. Glory shall be within grasp for each and every one of you. The best among you shall have the honor to face our reigning champion, the famed Grégoire de Gourgon, victor of last year's tourney. Celebrate, make merry, revel as you will, yet be mindful of the trial that awaits you tomorrow. Follow her. We shall meet in your tent before your last contest. You must help her. Good tidings? Can't believe it. Simply can't. Congratulations on your... Yes, sir. Oh. Oh. Geralt of Rivia. You wrested Fox Hollow from Lough Halfred's clutches. You deserve a monument for that. I'm listening, Sarah. Greetings. Salut. I'm listening, Sarah. Witcher act always with reason. They say a great I deal shall about go. Ah. Welcome, welcome.
so long. Eat, drink, and be merry. Thus spake the prophet Leviota. The Duchess is usually very kind. Until suddenly she is very un. Oh, excuse you. I shall be famous one day. I shall be famous one day, as famous as you. Witcher! Good luck on Up!
so long.